Today, people in Woodford County are working to clean up the mess left behind by this weekend's storms. Wind speeds of up to 50 miles knocked down some trees, even did some damage at a horse farm. Kylan Mills gives us a look in the big story at six. Aside from a few munching horses, all is quiet at Gray Ridge Farm in Woodford County. You could call it the calm after the storm. When it was blowing rain sideways and we kind of battened down the hatches and we, the crew was out back here working in some of the back stalls and actually a couple of them got trapped in the stalls because of the rain coming in and blew and blew and blew. Farm owner Brett Day says they were preparing their barns for severe weather when a storm barreled through on Saturday afternoon. But Mother Nature didn't stop there. We knew there was a second wave coming through because we watched the weather pretty closely, but we didn't think it was going to be like that. That was a pretty big surprise. Day says a pretty big surprise was finding the several ton outbuilding used by their world champion broodmares had been flipped over on Saturday night. Luckily, all the horses were okay. I kidded yesterday after the shock of seeing it roll over because the broodmares are kind of my wife Susie's uh, deal here at the farm and uh, we all kind of laughed and said we, we wanted to know who flipped over my wife she shit. Also in Woodford County just a couple of miles away part of the trunk of this massive tree broke off from those strong winds on Saturday. The entire thing came crashing down on top of this home breaking through the roof completely. Neighbors and the homeowners tell me it's amazing that no one here was hurt. But the first thing I Notice when I pulled in the subdivision was the tree on my neighbor's house, which I was really shocked and surprised. The homeowners say the part of the roof that smashed in mostly covers their attached garage. They told me they feel fortunate and are thankful for support from neighbors. Kylan Mills, LEX 18 News.